This is Bui from Mama Bui's Kitchen. I hope you're having a great day. Today, guys, we're gonna make waffles with berries and whipped cream. Then we're gonna garnish them with fresh mint. So let's get started. We're gonna start with our dry ingredients. In a medium bowl, we're gonna sift together flour, salt, baking powder, and sugar. Then we're gonna set it aside. Now let's move on to wet ingredients. In a separate bowl, combine the egg yolks, milk, canola oil, and give it a good whisk. Then set it aside. Back to our dry ingredients. I'm gonna make a well in the center of the dry ingredients and pour in yolk mixture. Stir well with a spatula. Mix better only until all visible streaks of dry ingredients are gone and some lumps remain. Living lumps will give you a fluffier and more tender waffle in the long run. Along with the baking powder, there is the other raisin agent. Eggs is also used. Into my bowl, I have about two egg whites. I'm gonna beat them until soft and foamy. Just like so, guys. Gently fold egg whites into the batter using a spatula. This is the consistency I'm looking for. Our waffle iron is preheated. I'm gonna grease it with the baking spray if necessary. Then I'm gonna little about half a cup of butter into each mold. Really, the exact quantity depends on your waffle iron. To tell that the waffle is done, watch the steam as it comes out of the unit as you cook. When the steam stops, lift the lid, the waffle should be done. We're gonna cook our waffles until they are golden brown. The steam has stopped. Now we're gonna remove the waffles. I'm gonna place them on the cooling rack. Now I'm gonna repeat the same process with the remaining batter. I have my oven preheated at 350 Fahrenheit. I'm gonna pop my waffles into the oven for five minutes so they stay extra crunchy and stay warm until ready to use. Let me know your toppings, guys. With this recipe, it just goes about anything. You can serve it with banana, strawberries, chocolate. Share it with your friends and your family. And please subscribe. Until next time, guys. Bye. Honey for my honey.